now this is what you would do you go to fertility leave which we call susumasa leave with either shinab or water that you pray to this leave this tree that anytime you marry or you are with any man or any woman the person does not stay then misunderstanding come and then your marriage or your relationship will you know destroy now you don't want this thing to happen again you have seen somebody or you are with somebody that you don't want that thing to happen again so you have come to get protection from the tree that this relationship or this marriage you want it to last you want it to you know stay forever and ever after saying all your hard desire with pouring the snap or the water down the leave the one that is having seven pains you get that seven 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 pieces of that seven then you get this leave the leave i post on the screen which i tag it's called yimifi obonier for aquam or hulepepe i know some of the nigerians who know this leaf. it's called hulepepe when you chew it it's it's like somebody who have drank a hot water it's very 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 powerful this leaf is used to you know do a lot of things good and bad things to destroy to kill to deport it does a lot of things but the thing that this leaf like most is we ganja ganja we uh-huh. if you have helped somebody that the person is misbehaving on you and you want to punish the person just get we we and go to this leaf or this helps and you know just perform your things less than a week the person will be deported to the country i'm not going to talk about that so after getting this leaf in susumasa you mash them in the water you mash them very well in the water then you use that water to bath when you are done go to any river at all you know any river you know will snap when you go you tell the river that you have been through a lot of relationship or marriage but the marriage doesn't last now this person that you are with you don't want the person to go again you want the person to stay with you the way the river when air blew whatever happens it moves but it stays at one place you are here to collect sand under the water to protect your marriage to protect your relationship after saying everything with your shinap pouring the shinap in the water and all that then you collect sand under the water now when you are done come outside do the same thing and collect sand also outside now go to where well, if you have mortar is it mortar what they pound fufu inside if you can do it yourself or if somebody is pound fufu you can get that one where they put the metal sorry the mortar collect sand and if that mortar is used for marriage uh protection we used to protect marriage yes so you collect sand under that mortar if you don't get the sand you can cut some of the mortar not old one but the one that they use in the house you can cut small one and add it to the things when you are done you write your name with your partner's name on a piece of paper we have this leave we call actually a check 
or article away. When you get that leaves, you can write your name with your partner's name on other one and you use the name to face each other and you type it you add it to it go to any big tree that you know any big tree with a snap when you get there remove your sandals or your shoe talk to the tree and say you have come to plead something from it the way it has turned very strong that every animal everything come upon it but here still it doesn't fall down you are here to protect your marriage your marriage or your relationship as well after saying all your intention or say whatever you want to say you dig under this tree now before you collect the sand from the mortar you will say that the way if they pound fufu, it doesn't fall, doesn't move, but it stay at one place. You want your marriage or your relationship to, you know, stay calm like that. Then you collect the sand. So when you go to the big tree, after digging, after digging, what you have to do is you put the name and in the hole. Then you drop all the sand that you have taken on top of the name. Then you pour your liberation as well that you are leaving this thing over here. That you want your marriage or your relationship to last longer. That nobody can separate you to. Or your marriage or your relationship to last till thy kingdom come after saying whatever you want to say when you are going to do it and you are going to put the things in the hole you get egg egg the one that the hen has you know laid that yeah, has breaking the rest bar there's one that the hen was not able to break you add that egg to the items before you bury it and you cover it nicer and go home that's all you know marriage marriage and relationship we plant them we build them our ancestors they don't just get up and marry they plant their marriages so there there are a lot of things we do to protect marriages if you don't protect your marriage always will be having problem unless you know that the person that you are with the person is no good or you don't like the person there are some certain things or some things you don't like about the person that you don't want to protect it but if you want to protect your marriage my brother my sister do that now yes do that now you have one you can use your picture you can use the picture of the person one you can use padlock to lock your wife private parts that no man no man no man penis can penetrate or can enter your wife thank you